Okay, worst ending. Snorpy! There they are. Where in Grump's name have you two been? I'll explain later. The bug snacks are coming to wipe us out. We gotta get off this island now. <laughs> Never mind. Buddy, you better put that trap to good use. Oh no. It's an army of angry strabbies. No! <laughs> I never thought I'd see an army of angry Google-eyed strawberries chasing me down. Oh, they're going after Philbo. <laughs> use the force, Philbo. Philbo's invincible, dude. Nice job. I'll be fine for now, buddy. Go and help the others. I'll have the balloon ready by the time you get back. Sounds good, Philbo. Will do. Stay still, you pugnacious <laughs> pests! I'm a scientist, not an exterminator. You do it if you're so inclined. One is strictly a pacifist. Not enough. Ah, but here comes someone with a healthy capacity for violence. But what if I don't have a healthy capacity for violence? What if I'm not violent? I'm a pacifist too. I don't want to hurt them. Just don't numb them. Is that so hard? Why are you numbing them? No numb. They're bad. Oh, Picantus. Stop numbing them. Oh, no. That's a full conversion. This is bad. One is devoted. One is wise. One is pure. The bug snacks have no power over me. Feel it. The precipice in bug snacks, potential to understand the very nature of being, would be a fool not to indulge. No, don't indulge. They're both dead. Oh, my gosh. Come on, snacks. Let's see what you got. Don't worry, snort dog. I could do this all day. How about you just don't numb the cookies? Don't eat the Oreo spiders. Just don't numb them. They're not yumsies. Don't numb, okay? No numb. No, don't numb them. Don't numb the chippies either. The chocolate chip cookies are bad. That's a full conversion. I can't take them all. Gotta protect Snorpy. I'll never be strong enough. I gotta be more than me. I gotta be. That's not true. Snacks. I see what you're doing, you delectable automatons. I know too much. I have to be destroyed. It's the only way to keep Chandlo safe. You win, Grumpinati. Your secrets die with no. me. Chandlo Snorpy. Now there's Cromdo and Befica. Just don't eat the Cheetos, all right? They're not yumsies. I know they're cheesy. They look delicious. But they're parasites. They're evil. Do not numb them. No, don't. Do not give in to their love. It's false. You have a barrel. Push them away. Oh, no. Now the sweetie flies. Do not eat the candy dragonflies. They're evil. Look at them. They're making angry faces. Now, I know they make love at the end, but that doesn't count. Oh, no. That's a full transformation. He went from being almost fully furred to now being fully blue candy. I mean, I'll admit it looks pretty cool. Probably tastes nice. But don't give in. I there's no point in going back with them. I don't have a life or friends. Nobody I can really trust anyway. But bug snacks, I can trust you to be delicious. Oh no, but don't become one of them. You can't numb them that way. Well, I can't bring myself to, to hurt them. So why'd Snorpy have to go and weaponize Sprout? Ramble, I didn't know you were so punk <laughs> Not a punk or a rock. <laughs> I can't do this. Well, I know who can. Darling, I've got them all warmed up. It's time for you to bring the house down. Why do I have to do that? Just don't eat them. I mean, look, those oranges are just rubbing all over the dirt. Do they even seem appetizing to you at this point? Oh, no, he lost his hat. His precious strabby hat. Oh, no, I think he's close to a full conversion. And there it is. Oh, oh. no. <laughs> Did you walk into Sprout? They call me a faded star. But for just this moment, I will burn bright again. This is my swan song. I will devote my final ballet to bug snacks. Oh. There, there, little one. I would never abandon you. We're a family now. We're gonna be together forever. That's not a good thing. Your fellow Grumpuses were your true family. Oh, no. Just don't numb the bunger. Oh, gosh. They're so big, too. How does it even fit in your mouth? They are gigantic. I'm such a failure. I couldn't even control my hunger. No wonder nobody believed in me. Wampus, that's not this true. This is the end. Yeah, I was going to end up here one way or another. Not that it mattered anyhow. Only thing that matters out here is Buck Snacks. Holy crap, Wampus, that wasn't true. Triffany, no. They've just dissociated into bug snacks, into food. They've become one with the island, all of them. Philbo, it's just me. Is this really everybody? What happened? <laughs> we gotta run, dude. Ah, never mind. We gotta get on board now. <laughs> Not a pizza. Oh, come on. We're not gonna make it. Thanks, 
Liz, Egg. Yeah, thank you too. Oh, jeez, dude, that's so sad. It's literally just me and Philbo. Literally, yeah, they're all dead. There's no one here. There's nobody to talk to because they're dead. They've become one with the Bug Snacks Island. Dang, I'm so sorry, Philbo. They're all gone. I have to admit, you got guts. Tracking down Elizabeth inside an erupting volcano? It's compelling, dramatic, sensational. I'd call it fiction if you didn't have this Philippus Yahoo along as a witness. <laughs> it's... Philbo, actually. Point is, you're a regular Grumpter S. Thompson. It's just too bad those bug snacks weren't real, huh? Ah, uh, yeah, sure. Yeah, too bad. <laughs> I, I, I hate to think that we went through all that for nothing. So, um, I hope you can spread the truth about Snack Tooth before anybody else gets hurt. Don't worry. GNN specializes in painful truths. And speaking of, you're fired. This what? story's a page turner and all, but you lost your job the second you walked out that door. Hey, I got you this story and you're gonna fire me? Oh, please. It's not like I expected you to come back. Also, you're legally dead. Might want to clear that up soon. Oof. <laughs> well, that wasn't ideal, but you've had worse days, huh, buddy? So... I hear the elections are coming up, and, uh, I was thinking of running for mayor. I could use a helping paw. How about it? Sure, I'll help you out. Wait, wait, wait why are you eating them? <laughs> what do you mean, yum? Don't numb them. Stop opening wine. You sound like you're enjoying it. Don't numb them. They're bad. I can feel it. The precipice. Eating bug snacks. Potential to understand the very nature of being. Would be a fool not to indulge. <gasps> Not even you deserved that! Oh my gosh, Floofty, what happened? Oh no. Don't! Why? Why are you willingly open your mouths for them? I see what you're doing, you delectable automatons. I know too much. I have to be destroyed. It's the only way to keep Chandlo safe. You win, Grumpinati. Your secrets die with me. Snorpy! <gasps> no! Snorpy. The cheap oofs. Just don't numb them. They're coming in, but do not numb. Keep the mouth closed. No! Why are you open so wide? Have you learned your lesson? Do not numb the sweetie flies. They look like adorably delicious lollipop dragonflies, but do not numb them. Don't! Why are you- You're not listening to me. There's no point in going back with them. I don't have a life or friends. Nobody I can really trust anyway. But bug snacks, I can trust you to be delicious. That's all you have to say? Sorry, Beth? That's it? They call me a faded star, but for just this moment, I will burn bright again. This is my swan song. I will devote my final ballet to bug snacks. Fuego! <laughs> wow, why'd you have to go? Oh, no. I thought Bunger was friend. No, don't numb the Bunger. Bunger bad. This is the end. I was gonna end up here one way or another. Not that it mattered anyhow. Only thing that matters out here is Bug Snacks. Trophy! Oh, that, that can't be. Triffany, just a pile of weenies. Is this really everybody? What happened? No, no. I'm sorry, Phil, but we gotta run. Oh no, there's not many of them left. And they're gonna be so sad about losing their partners and friends. I'm sorry, Triffy. I know what you wanted most was to be remembered. So I'll remember you every day. I'll buy back our old house. I'll preserve it. Everything you and me ever did. I'll pass it down so nobody ever forgets. That's so sad. He really wants to honor his dead wife and her wishes. Wiggle, why'd you have to go and leave me? I finally had somebody who cared about me, but it was nice while it lasted. I promise you, I'll carry your love with me, and I won't go giving it away to things that don't deserve it. Aw, poor Gramble. I'm so sorry. Okay, I know when I'm beat. I draw the line at island full of monsters. <laughs> All I wanted to do was quit my dead-end job and do what makes me happy. I don't need some big bug snack scam to do that. Hey, maybe I'll get started in the music business. And you're smiling. You really don't care that Befica died. I mean, I know you two weren't partners or anything, but gee, all right. Not what I expected, Cromdo. So our doom came. But what did I really do to stop it? I spoke loudly, yes, but I made the speaker more important than the message. Despite our bickering, I know this world is a poor place without Floofty. Aww. They had so much potential to do good. Though I'll have to do good in their place. No more cryptic riddles. No divine shroud. Just me. I think they'd appreciate that. Aww. Even Shelda had something to say about Floofty. Cromdo, why the heck didn't you have anything to say about Befica? That's really sweet, Shelda. It's okay. I'm gonna give you a hug. 
amazing together, Snorpy. I feel so weak without you. There's never gonna be another Snorpington Fizzlebean. Not in a million years. And dog, if the Grumpinati are out there, I'm gonna crush them. Dang. Well, they deserve it. So this is the bad ending with everyone commenting on their partners, rivals, significant others, etc. Except Cromdo. Befica also, I tested, didn't have anything to say either about Cromdo dying, which was interesting. But everyone else does have something to say about their partners. Time to get the true ending. That's enough mortal danger for one day. Let's abscond while the bug snacks have subsided. You don't have to tell me twice. You, however, must continue. The others still need your help. Then I will help them. Let's go. We crushed it, dog. I'm gonna give you the hug of your life. <laughs> don't celebrate too soon. We're not safe until we're off this horrid rock. To the balloon. Man, apparently this horrid rock is all made of bug snack. Oh. Oh. oh, it looked pretty nasty for a sec, but I knew you'd pull through, bestie. <laughs> we Thanks. made it! <laughs> that means Snorpy owes me five bucks. Let's blow this popsicle stand, huh? Yes, let's. Is it over? Please say it's over. My heart can't take much more of this. No time for an encore, Gramble dear. We better boogie. <laughs> I love the way Wiggle talks. That's about as big a break as we're gonna get. Come on, Wambi. It's now or never. I gave it my best. All right, Triffy. Let's go home. Aw, they're so sweet. Looks like we saved everyone. Time to get out of here. Okay. We're all here, though I think the balloon needs another minute. <laughs> Never mind. We gotta get on board now. Nice. Everybody's here. <laughs> Even the cactus is here. Well, there goes another farm. Serves me right for building it on top of an island-sized pest. I guess there's no shame in starting fresh. I'll find a place with rich soil and even richer history where me and Trippy can settle down. Oh, that's the spirit. Never give up. I was so close to giving up back there. I get so caught up dwelling on the way lives end. But that's not the only thing that matters. Yeah, Wambus and I, we're going to start the rest of our lives today. Oh, that's sweet. See, now she's smiling too. We're going to make him happy. It's funny. I spent all my time chasing one muse. And as soon as I put it out of my mind, another strikes me. As we floated down from the sky, watching our... Our home crumbled to dust. A little song sprung into my head. I call it an ode to Gramble. Oh, that's sweet. You made a song about your boyfriend. Thought I'd be real sad when I left all my little ones behind, but I feel okay. I don't know. Maybe it helps they try to murder me. <laughs> but also, I got folks who love me back for real. Like, well, Wiggle. That's true. You two are very sweet together. Uh, hey, bestie. I think I need a vacay from this vacay. Going home doesn't seem so bad anymore. My old life, my old friends are all gone. Aww. But like, now I know that I can make new friends. And this time, I won't ruin it for myself. That's right. Believe in yourself. Everything will be okay. Okay. I know when I'm beat. I draw the line at island full of monsters. <laughs> <laughs> all I wanted to do was quit my dead-end job and do what makes me happy. I don't need some big bug snack scam to do that. Hey, maybe I'll get started in the music business. Go for it, pal. While I regret that all my research was destroyed, I have come away with a revelation. I cannot improve Grump is kind if I refuse to understand it. It may be a long and frankly annoying endeavor, but it is one worth pursuing. Then pursue it. I've never felt so wrong being right. Wish I hadn't wasted so much time telling riddles. I don't need to be all powerful to give good advice. I just need to be me. And those who listen will listen. That is also true. Look at that mess. Seems my enemies aren't so all powerful after all. But still, there were many close calls, and Chandler was always there for me. I think. Perhaps I could share everything with him. You should. You're lucky to have him. Bro, that was intense. There's no way I ever would have made it out of there by myself. Good thing Snorpy had my back. When did he get so strong? <laughs> Maybe I hit my personal limit. That doesn't matter. There's no limit to what we can do together. That's the spirit. All right, well, that's everyone. They're all smiling and looking at me. Time to go, Philbo. No, no, I sent them away. It would be hard to make them disappear at this point. Do they suspect anything? Hmm, hard to say. Could be they're idiots. Could be they know the truth and they're keeping it quiet. Very well. We will have to keep our eye on them. Two quid. It does. Omne Vivamex bug snacks. The editor was in on it. Strabby joined us on the boat. Clumpy, pick up. Somebody's been through my tapes. Clumpy, the secret tapes in the secret place. They know. How could anybody even find them? That is such a violation of my privacy. It had to be them. 
Lisbert, Screw, Flibbo, Tiffany, Wampus, whatever their names are. Well then, I have a task for you, Miss Clumbernut. Find out everything you can about these so-called survivors of Snacktooth. We'll see how they like it when I learn all of their secrets. So, yeah, call me back when you get this. This is Jamford, by the way. Okay, bye. Well, there you have it. Those are all the Bug Snacks endings. It's crazy how dark this game can get, but now you have seen with me exactly how it goes. If you like this video, please leave a like and comment. It does help out a lot. But that's going to be it for tonight. Thank you for tuning in. Hope you had fun. And I'll catch you next time.